Welcome back. We are Pokemon, Pokemon Masters at the game. We are still a red-colored boy. Yep. Uh, and I, I think how are our elves? Between then and now, I <gasps> learned it's night. We can get a hoo hoo. Oh my gosh! It just became night. It literally just switched over while I was in the menu. Oh my gosh! Can we please catch a hoot hoot? Okay. Or a Poliwag. Do you need a water type Pokemon? I think so. If we need a water type Pokemon, we definitely can catch Poliwags right now. Awesome. I think there have some in the forest. They have them, um, yeah, like in the first couple routes. Because I, uh, I was playing a little bit of this on my own in my free time just to um, kind of figure out what was happening with us changing characters. Yeah. And I uh, found out that it's actually the, the emulator that we're using. I don't know how or why, but for some reason when you reload the game through this emulator, it slowly changes your character. Weird. A thing to ask is it real the missile bomb re relives? What? It's you to beat them down, really? Then show off your strength to see. Man, we have like six elves. And he's got like none on us. He's got three. <laughs> oh, I forgot we named I forgot who's a penis. penis. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's been, what, three weeks since we played this last? Yeah, so this is going to be a little... a long time. God, I do you remember the attacks? Um, I remember this is bite, isn't it? I think you're right. Yes, it is. Wait. Oh, bite is a dark type move now. Yeah. I forgot that they added dark and steel to this second gen. It's just a big learning day. Yeah. Yeah, it is. Learning all sorts of. Oh, <gasps> so bad. I meant Jeeb. 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 Uh, what are my elves? Start, 15, 13. You, you need some training. Five, Al Al. Who's Al Al? Uh, it's Onyx. Oh, yeah. Go away, you pupilless Onyx. Oh, rock-type moves are super effective against flying-type moves. Did you just yawn in the middle of that? Yeah. Dude, don't yawn. I'm sorry. Be awake for the good people at home. Okay. You fool. Alright. Awake. Are you gonna try to kill that using bind the entire time? I just forgot what they meant. I like how band is also bind. <laughs> yeah. I also like that when it's wrapped up, it's unhearing. So like, it's like covering its ears. So you're not trying to crush its body, so you're just like making it so you can't. I think unhearing actually is because he's trying to use supersonic on me and it's saying I'm not hearing it. Oh. Yeah. I think it makes a little more sense. Maybe. Huh. Yeah. So, in the time between uh, now and then. Now and, yeah, the last time we recorded. Yeah. Uh, we we did some fun things outside. Yes. Uh, Kane, you went back home, didn't you? Yeah, I flew flew up to Portland. Yeah. Just met some family. <gasps> Madam. Oh, its name is Madam. It's little Madam. What is Volt? Let's find out. Uh Find it does nothing. Wait, take a guess. What Volt. do you think? What do you think Volt is? Volt. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna guess uh, Rock, Rock Throw. Tomb. I don't think Rock Tomb exists yet. You're probably right. I think Rock Throw. It's probably Rock Throw. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. It is Rock Throw. <laughs> Look at that damage. But yeah, I was in Portland. It was nice. Mm -hmm. It was actually hotter there than it was in LA. What? Yeah. Oh, weird. It was like, well, right now it's about the same temperature that it was there. Yeah. When I was there. Mm -hmm. So it's like, it was like 106. It was, it was stupid. Stupidly hot there, but it was like in the 60s back home back here. Yeah. Yeah So I brought 
I, I got to experience like the worst of their summer. Yeah. And now I get to experience the worst of our summer. Gross. It's okay. Uh, what about you? What what was he, what was that, what were your shenanigans up to? Uh, well, I went to the roller rink. I had a great time. I learned how to do roller derby, which is a really fun sport. Like by a, the way, like by yourself? No, no. I, went, I didn't just go to the roller rink by my by myself. I took friends. <laughs> I didn't know if you wanted to go. I don't know. Like become a derby. And, like made it a challenge. Uh, but it was it was a really good time. Yeah. Um. <clears throat> Uh, and we all we all guessed songs that we wanted to play yeah. by the DJ, and uh, mine was "Don't Stop Till You Get Enough" by Michael Jackson. Mm-hmm. And uh, what ended up happening was that during during the playing of uh, "Can't Stop the Feeling," Justin Timberlake song, yeah, you know, that just came out not long ago. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah. During while well, they were playing that. I got a little overexcited because I I didn't know how to how to roller skate at all. Yeah. Wait, and at I, all? No, I'd never roller skated before. Your first before. time in roller skating? Yeah. Now, did you use roller skates or roller blades? Roller skates because I'm man enough. I think roller skates are way easier to use than roller blades. That's what I'm saying. Roller skates are easier to use than roller blades. Yeah. Which makes them appear sissier, which is why I'm man enough to wear them. I see. Yeah. Okay. Okay. It's like. How I'm man enough to wear pink. Yeah, I got yeah. it. Yeah. Um, anyway. Uh-huh. So, uh, I got really, really excited because I, I got pretty good, and I was like, oh, I can do this. Yeah. And I ended up skating straight into a wall, and I turned my ankle over, and I've been oh. on, I was on a cane for, like, the last week. Oh, but not me. You were uh, on a different cane. Yeah, I was, I was all over that cane. Oh, um, okay. And I, uh... Hurts my feelings a little bit. Yeah, well, I'm sorry. He knew how to treat me. I'm sorry, it Good. knew how to treat me. It Good. didn't have a gender. It was an object. Good point. Um, yeah, so I used that since. But anyway, I, I ended up rolling my ankle over, and uh, everybody else was kind of skating around. My other friends were skating. Did someone roll over your ankle? No. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I told you what happened. Yeah. It rolled into a wall. Yeah. And uh, then, but right after I got hurt, uh-huh. I, I went off and I took a song off and I was like, that's all right, it's just like a sprain, I can get over it. And it became very abundantly clear very quickly that I couldn't actually get over it right away. <laughs> and I was like, oh shit, now I gotta sit this out for the rest of the night. And as soon as I sort of come to terms with that, <laughs> Don't stop till you get enough comes on. <laughs> and I was like, oh, shit. This is the one I called. I have to skate. Oh, so uh, I skated. so I went back out <laughs> and I skated around to that song. And I was like, this is a horrible decision. And uh, <laughs> uh, the other I won't use their last names, but Sierra and Alex and Jackson were out. And they're yeah. like, yeah, way to go. <laughs> but also, bad idea, Jacob. Yeah. Oh man. Well, you're okay now. Yay. Kane helped you. The other Kane. Yeah, the the object Kane. The object Kane helped you. And uh and you're doing alright now. Yay. That's what really matters. That's in the long run, that's what really matters. And also matters. you know how to roller skate, so That's true. That's pretty cool. So you didn't ever have like when you were a kid, like, street hockey out on the side with, like, kids who, like, fucking, like, the goalies had, like, roller blades. No, I I grew up in a, like, rural town. That's a good point. There wasn't a whole lot of hockey going on. There were streets. There weren't a whole lot of streets, that's true. Yeah. Like, I mean, it's not like it was a dirt road. There were paved <laughs> streets. It's just... No, but the, there weren't, like, a lot of, like, houses around those streets. It's like trees. It's Yeah, I guess... I'm not sure that's totally accurate either. Yeah. But it, it just, it's not the environment one would play street hockey in. Because there's not, there aren't enough kids, actually, I think what it is at the end of the day. That's probably... There's just not enough kids. That's probably it. Everybody's kind of spread out. Yeah. How long did it take you to, like, go to a friend's house? Like, if you... As a kid? Yeah, as a kid. Like, in your old town. Like, if you... I had a friend that lived two houses away when I was like eight, but then I, 
I didn't really talk to him when we were in like middle school. It was sort of like when we were kids. We yeah. Hung out. Um. Are we following the Okong? Yeah, Okong. Is that what Noctowl is? I think it's a farfetch. Oh. If my memory serves me correctly. Fearful. No. Are we trying to catch it? What? No, How? we gotta get it back to the guy. Oh, Dan on that. No, this is a corn. <laughs> 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 it's a good thing we already have a poison type and a bug type. Or else we'd need corns. Yep. Take that, you gnat. No. It's a nasty gnat. Venom gnat doesn't really look that much like a gnat. Like, gnats have wings. Yeah, it's true. You know, I don't think I actually talked to that kid. Let's just see what he has to say. Why are you falling? What are you in? <gasps> in Do you not a... remember this? The forest? Yeah. Mm. Oh, you're in the forest. I'm in the forest. I find this... I find it really strange that you don't remember this. Mostly I because it, it was a big deal for me as a kid. So, like, I've, I've got a lot of parts of this game memorized. It's been a long... I only played... This was the first one I ever played. Uh. And it... I never played it again. Mm -hmm. So... I find that strange, just because, I mean, I... It was a bigger deal for me when Ruby and Sapphire came out. Mm-hmm. Well, I guess, because I I don't play as many video games as you. It's true. And, um, it's probably been even longer since I played this game, since last you played this game. Yes. But just because I played this so much as a kid, mm -hmm. I have this shoved into my, my brain, into my memory... Yeah, I... So I just, I'm like, well, how can you not remember this? We have to chase the far-fetched around and give it to the kids. See, I have the entire first game memorized completely. Mm -hmm. Like, just completely. Like, I know where everything is, I know where most of the routes are, uh, or most of the Pokemon that you can find in every single route. Mm -hmm. Like, completely memorized. Ruby and Sapphire is pretty similar to me, too, because I played a lot of that. Yeah. Um, but Red and Blue and the remakes of Fire Red and Leaf Green, I'm like, they're my jam. Crazy. Yeah. Always loud at set time, bring it as clock. It's a hee hee. No, I don't want to name it. <gasps> hee hee pet name. Aw, oh, that's cute. Okay. Though. Let's go talk to the kid. I didn't actually talk to him. I didn't feel the need to because... You already knew what to do. You. Yeah. But that's the fun of this game is that it's translated so weird so we get to be like, hey, what's, what's happening? <laughs> Wow, the grass jump out. That would terrify me if grass jumped out at me. And it was wild. <laughs> wild grass. I always feel like it's... Like, you know, we say go away for every Pokemon that we switch out, but I always feel like it's aggressive when it's Onyx. Because he looks aggressive. We send him out and he goes... <sighs> yeah. Like, look at that face. <sighs> I have no pupils. Ann's grass convey. Ha, 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 ha. Is that sweet scent? Ha, 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 ha. That's Onyx responding to you. Ha, 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 ha. Sorry, Onyx, I wasn't sure. Did no! You get... <laughs> Did you get sweet? No! Um, Onyx? <laughs> How to do, the boss is afraid, chop off the tree, which can change into char. Char what? Get lost. One is in the dark and clear forest, be afraid of walking. Don't speak to me in riddles. Uh, yeah, that, that really does sound like a riddle. <laughs> yeah. It, it just sort of rhymes enough. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And it sounds sort of like, chop off the tree to get the char. <laughs> yeah. What runs with its head towards its bed and whatever else? Yeah. Clearly corn is the answer. <laughs> I remember... This is, like, weird for me. Maybe I didn't play this game enough at nighttime, so I'm not used to all the nighttime Pokemon that you see. Yeah? Um, you know, because, again, like, the favorite of the two um, Eevee illusions of this game was Espeon and, like... Uh, my favorite was Umbreon. 
Wait, did we have this exact conversation? Yeah, we were the yin and yang. Oh I'm my god. Sure, I'm pretty sure that was the conversation. But I don't remember a lot of the, like, the 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 Pokemon that you can find at nighttime because I didn't remember learning about that concept until like after I had beaten the game and yeah. people were like hey so you know you can catch these at night and I was like what that's my bedtime but, that's my bedtime but anyway um yeah I I don't it feels like weird for me seeing that you see all these like venomats yeah even though it's common at night in the forest yeah and I'm like uh. Because Venonets are kind of rare. I mean, mm -hmm. they're not super rare, but they're like kind of rare. Yeah. In red and blue. Like, they're more rare. Like, who has a Venomoth? I, think yeah, I don't Co know. Koga has a Venomoth. Yeah. That's like it. No one else has a Venomoth. Except for, except for maybe some people at Victory Road. But, yeah. like, it seems like a pretty rare Pokemon in the first 150. And so it's weird for me just, like, seeing an abundance of it. Yeah. Yeah. That makes sense. Yeah. That's Still. crazy. What's your What's your favorite Pokemon type? Did we talk about this? Um, I think so, because I mentioned Ghost, and you're like, there's only three Ghosts. Oh, yeah. Is there more Ghost? Yeah, there's there's Misdreavous in this one. Yeah. But that always did tick me off, because I like Ghosts, and I love Ghosts as an idea, and yeah. I think it's so cool that you just get to battle as Ghosts. Yeah. But they only made three, four when I was a kid, you know, when these games came out. Yeah. And... <gasps> in the first generation... Do we... We need a water type. I thought we were going to catch a Neelem. Do we want a Neelem or do we want a Coda? Something Co tells me you're going to want a Neelem, which is exactly why I'm catching this Coda. Well, it's do you want a water psychic type or a water fighting type? Hmm. Unless you want to not evolve into a Polyrath, which is dumb, but... Maybe I got... Big plans for this poly world. Poly toad. You, I can't get a poly toad. We can't trade. Oh yeah. I'm gonna catch Coda, cause he just kind of, she just kind of came out of nowhere. Which I, th I'm gonna be like, hey, that's a, yeah, good enough reason. Cause our Anan is pretty useless right now. Especially cause it fainted. <laughs> it's useless fainted. It's true. Tail saw, but not decided. <laughs> I feel like this is a very accurate Psyduck to the anime Psyduck. Probably. Mm hmm Boom. Can we do it? <gasps> we can do can it. Can we do it? We can do it. Can we catch the Coda? Can we catch the Coda? Let's find out. <gasps> we have one more huge ball. Next time! Oh. 